two sessions in Beijing are very important for the next steps in overall development of China. And I'm really happy to see education as one of the most anticipated topics uh, that will be covered uh, in these sessions. As a leader of an international school in China, I'm really interested in what will be the feedback on topics connected with education in, in those sessions. Additionally, I'm uh, curious on what further policies will come from the discussions happening there. Generally speaking, uh, for us, our local government supports us a lot. It's really open for suggestions as well as it provides guidance that is necessary for our day-to-day -day and overall operations and progress. Um, we work uh, very well with our respective education bureau and we accept really all decisions that come our way. Uh, they were really supportive during COVID times and they helped us run as smooth as possible during uh, many pandemics, pandemic obstacles. Uh, Hangzhou has a, a lot of connection with international trades and it's a really important part of Zhejiang's and, and Chinese economy. Education plays a really important role in uh, that part of Hangzhou development. Um, regarding hands-on policies and advices from those two sessions, uh, as an executive principal in Wahaha International School in Hangzhou, I really hope they can focus more on some of the topics I will mention. Some of them, I really hope they will establish more policies to encourage more internationally focused courses in the school's curriculum. Uh, I hope they can work on providing more resources to support uh, development of international schools, like funding of international exchange programs or teacher training programs or other student-related activities. Um, maybe they can even organize uh, international education forums where foreign experts can be invited and maybe share latest trends in this field. From my previous experience as principal in bilingual school, I feel bilingual schools are most, have more structured trainings and funding systems from a government. So that is maybe one part us as an international educators may need in, in Hangzhou International School. Uh, hope they can also encourage innovation in education a little bit more. Um, to support that, maybe they can organize an exchange or fairs with a, with a focus on innovation in, in education. I believe that is really something necessary for, for us to, to, to broaden our development. Uh, of course, all of these suggestions and all the goals that we have, we hope that the achievements can be shared with us, that policies can be also shared with us, and any adjustments they make, I hope they can be re-evaluated after a certain period of time. Uh, no doubt many new items will be shared and we are looking forward for guidance and decisions and we hope some of these suggestions can be taken into consideration for a growth of international education in Hangzhou.